Now to a developing story as Spokane police trying to figure out how a person fell to her death from the River Park Square parking garage this afternoon. Sacred Heart Medical Center says that she died at 645 tonight. At this point, they won't tell us much, not her name or even her age. Anusha Roy was on scene today and talked with people nearby. Scott Michael Conrad was sitting behind the counter at work this afternoon when the sounds of sirens caught his attention. Then we heard all the, the sirens from several cop cars and um, emergency vehicles like a fire truck and an ambulance. He went to check out what happened, only to be stopped. They wouldn't let us within a half of a block, so. Detectives were combing the scene at River Park Square Mall, investigating how a young female fell from the parking garage onto this ramp. We were trying to see if we could see an individual, and we couldn't. We just saw um, index cars and police taking pictures. The fall happened just before 3 from higher up in the garage. Detectives were on the scene looking into the circumstances of the fall. The mall says it's cooperating with the investigation. We just, you know, open up our, our cameras and, you know, help out any way we can. We talked to the general manager earlier today who believes the garage is safe. We take every precaution possible to ensure that we have a safe garage. So from a public standpoint, we are we are safe. The general manager says the mall's garage is completely fenced in. Steel plates are also installed for safety. Again, our hearts go out to the families and uh, just going to support the SPD until they can figure out what exactly happened. Manusha Roy, KXLY4 HD News. And back in 2003, a 50-year-old man jumped from the fourth floor of the atrium in front of the mall. And then in 2005, a woman died when her car broke through the barrier in the parking garage and landed on the ramp. After that, the garage made improvements and installed steel plates connecting the barriers.